Thank you. Thank you, uh, Tony. Tim, what's his name? Thanks, Tommy. Uh, oh, yes, I know what it is. Thank you, please, Tony. Thank you, Tony, uh, for those kind words you spoke directly before our entrances. Uh, I'm Terry Titter, all-round entertainer, with a song and a smile in my eyes. I have heart. Um, uh, to, uh, with my uh, friend and colleague, Count Arthur Strong, uh, to have a chat to you about the wonderful world of comedy. Entertainment is just giving, and this evening we'd like to give you the benefit of our experience in this biz we call show. Arthur. Um, uh, yes, uh, we will uh, uh, be using various approaches and techniques, revolutionary, in the field of the dramatic arts. Terry. Thank you. To teach is to demonstrate, Wait, and who better than the likes of us? You're not looking at snotty nose kids. Now, this is seasoned pros. Bin on the block. Uh, said it on bin uh, there on it for you, and I'm having it on a t-shirt. <laughs> Arthur. Thank you, Terry. <laughs> we will also be using. Various approaches <laughs> and techniques revolutionary in the field of the dramatic arts. Arthur O'Terry. So, without further ado, let us begin. And who better to begin than my dear friend and colleague, Count Arthur Strong, with some important advice for all you would-be performers on the first rung of a very, very long ladder. So I was never going to get through that. So did I. <laughs> um, thank you, Terry. Well said and delightfully put. I enjoyed saying it. <laughs> um, you know, when I was a little lad, I used to sit and read about the top film stars and matinee idols of the day. And I used to think to myself, it could never happen to me. And then I used to think, but well, why not? And then I used to think, because things like that just don't happen to me. And then I used to think, but that doesn't mean that they can't. Oh, and then I used to think, oh, I'm just being stupid. <laughs> and then I used to think, now, who are you calling stupid? <laughs> and then I used to think, come over here and say that. <laughs> and I would have gone on forever if the bus hadn't have come. <laughs> it's very important, before you go on to give a performance, that you warm your voice up fully in the proper fashion, you see. Just to sort of warm up the mouth and get the articulation to the fore. We used to do, um... What were we used to do? Um, <laughs> tongue twisters! Like, I rattled my bottles in Rolex's yard. We used to have a lot of fun with this one! <laughs> Sorry, it's all right, that's... Just be careful, that's all. <laughs> Bollocks! It's not... <laughs> Bollocks! It's not... Bollocks! <laughs> Not uh, bollocks, actually! Uh, uh, Butterless, buckles. My bottom in bollocks' yard. And there were more, you see, many, many more. But these are just to sort of warm up the mouth and get the articulation to the fore. Um, <laughs> Terry! <laughs> Thanks very much. Thank you. <clears throat> Ooh, you have to excuse me, I've had a big tea. Now. I'm going to tease you now. I, I'm going to tease you. Uh, with, this is the point in the show where, now, if we were making love now, I'd be, say, um, rubbing your tits and necking you. That sort of thing. Little tits. <laughs> um, assuming, of course, you are heterosexual, that's not to exclude our homosexual, lesbian, celibate and hermaphrodite friends. <laughs> um, you know, and if you don't come under that category, then please get on stage under the lights and let's have a look at you. Because, <laughs> I mean, that's got to be king of the freaks, that, though, hasn't it? Uh, I'm going to tease you now with a little sneaky peek into Teddy Tiss's box, right? <clears throat> OK, let's see what we've got here. We've got a little bit of a bloody atmosphere going in here, eh? Cough it up, might be a piano. You can have that. OK. Now, this is any right-hand man or woman. I'm not being sexist, sweetheart. All right, this is any right-hand person's... Uh, oh, this is this. Fantastic, this. Right, let's try it. Uh, that's a nice shirt, eh? It doesn't look as good on as it did in the catalogue, though, does it? <laughs> See how that perfectly backed up my side splitter? <laughs> you know, I went into a ladies' lingerie shop today. I went into a ladies' lingerie shop and I said, Can I have a see-through negligee, please, size 44, 40, 44? And the woman said to me, What the f the hell do you want to see through that for? <laughs> Come on, do the Samaritans know about you, lads? 
so on and so forth. Go easy on that, though, cos uh, I can get annoying. It, that it can get annoying. All right? <laughs> there you go. Uh, take that from what you want from that. Uh, I dare say they'll chop it up and make me look great, so that's me now, anyway. <laughs> All right. I'm done now. Go on for a little bevy here. Come in. Uh, I'll, I'll follow you up. I've just got a, a bit of tidying bevy. up and uh, clearing up to do down here first. Uh, Fantastic. Uh, so, you get on up there. I'll, 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 I'll see you up there. Right. No, he's out of the way. I'll show you a bit of a class act here. Bloody finale. Get me music on, Dennis. Come on. Right, listen. <laughs> Let's have a party! Ha ha! His name was Lola! Oko, oko, oko! Come on! I see her diamonds in the hair! The diamonds everywhere! She is my lady! My lovely lady! Oh, shut up! You said you were going the bath! This is what they paid for! You dislike! Ah, oh, shut up, you! You've ruined everything now, you see! She was a dancing queen! I said a dancing queen! She would you! Where are you? Come here, we can sort this out the box. We shouldn't be doing these chairs with my back. See you upstairs afterwards. Ooh. Ladies and gentlemen.